Drew Tube, Drew Tube. What up, guys? D Henny here. For Beer Review 3 with Triple V Hennessy. Coming to ya. Coming to ya. Coming to ya. Coming to ya. Get it. Gio. Tonight for you guys, I have a beautiful, beautiful beer review for you. Uh, I have the uh, 20th uh, anniversary edition uh, Rock Art uh, Double IPA. Um, nice looking can here, as you guys can see. Uh, pretty much all black with the big old 20 and a cool looking art figure guy there. Um, let's see here. Uh, 80 IBUs, 8% ABV. Um, let's get right into it. Let's get right into it. Let's get that pour that you guys have been waiting for. Boom. Always got to tap the top, you know? Got to tap the top, baby. Got to tap the top. Bam. Did you hear that? Did you hear that crisp, clean open? Here we go, guys. Here we go. I like that heavy angle when I pour my beers. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Would you guys take a look at that? I mean, does it get any better? Does it get any better? Whew. Man alive. Man alive. Look at that. Gotta get good down to the last drop, huh? Look at that. Ooh. Sorry, bad bad angle there. Bad angle there too. Well, we'll uh, forget that for now. Man, would you guys look at that? Look at the color on that. You know, obviously it looks like it's unfiltered. You know, you can see some uh, little pieces of sediment and whatnot around. Um, it's looking so darn good, guys. Uh, I think I need to get right into it. Oh, there it almost goes, all over the table. <laughs> Let's try it. Oh, just warms my cockles, I'll tell you. I mean, it's unbelievable. I mean, Vermont beer, you know, I know uh, my last uh, beer review was a happened to be rock art as well um and it just happened to be a coincidence uh i went into uh, one of my favorite uh beer stores um in vermont over here and uh i just happened to see this on the shelf and you know i've i've, I've had this one uh at least a couple few times before and uh it's just damn delicious i'll tell you it's uh well balanced um uh definitely some bitterness going on you know those the the, the 80 ibus there uh definitely adds a, a a good uh chunk of bitter to the uh to the to to the drink or the drank the drank or the drink the drink or the drank the drank or the drink yeah drink or the drink the drank or the drink yeah drink or the drink the drank or the drink yeah but uh I mean, from beginning to finish, uh, it's very satisfying to me. Um, lots of flavor, uh, I'd say, uh, and and hoppy. Um, a fair amount of hops in there for sure. Um, I I feel like I taste um, some fruity fruity characteristics uh, in this. You know, sort of maybe citrus a little bit. Um, Let's see here. Let me get a little more. Um, 
yeah, citrus, a little orange maybe, orange peel maybe, um, maybe a little lemon, uh, like I said, well balanced, uh, they, they, you know, do a good job at covering up that 8%, uh, ABV, alcohol by volume there, um, but, um, you know, what, uh, what beers do you guys like? Uh, what beers would you guys like for me to review? Uh, feel free to like, subscribe, leave a comment in the section down below. Boop, 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 boop. Um, I'm going to test out. I'm going to test out, uh. Y'all knowledge, y'all knowledge, y'all's knowledge, and uh, see, you know, how well you remember uh, the uh, information I told you in the last video. Um, my question for you guys is, where in Vermont is rock art beer made? What town in Vermont? Um, uh, do you guys get it? Did you figure it out? You guys know the answer or, um, maybe not, maybe not so much or, uh, did you get the answer? Um, the answer is Morrisville, Vermont. Well, let me tell you something, folks. When you have a good burp like that, uh, you know you're drinking on a damn good beer. It's like tasting the beer all over again when you burp. You know, you get all the, <laughs> you get all the, uh, the 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 hop notes and the fruit characteristics and things I was uh, just describing uh, previously. Um. Uh, you know, uh, something I wanted to mention to you guys is, uh, how aggressive the, the price of craft beer uh, has become, uh, these days. Uh, it's, it, it's, uh, becoming like a, like, you know, like a fine wine, um, really, uh, essentially, um, nowadays, you know, 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 well, now that I said it four times, four times in a row, um, basically, so basically, <laughs> so basically, um, either way, uh, either way, um, either way, what I was trying to say is, I don't know, because I totally lost my train of thought, but uh, if you guys can remember, like, subscribe, leave a comment in the section below. <laughs> And I'll continue that thought in the next video. Um, mm, I mean, every time, every time it's uh, that good, you know? Oh, oh, beg my pardon, beg my pardon, guys. Uh, right, right, right. The price of craft beer. Uh, this one, you know, eh, up there. But not like some of them. I mean, uh, some of them are, are are heavy. You know, you know, you can pretty much drop uh, close to twenty dollars or twenty dollars on a uh, really good craft, you know, four pack of beer. And uh, is it worth it? I'd say for the most part, yes, absolutely, hundred um, percent. There's definitely, you know, some companies out there that make their label look good and yada, 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 you know, all this and that, you know, everything looks good and, you know, you know, the price is up there, so you think it's going to be good. Uh, and, you know, it, it doesn't always turn out being, you know, the best beer alive. But, uh, you know, um, basically, basically, Larry? Hold on, guys. I'm getting a call. I'm getting a call. Larry? Larry? Polarity? Larry? 
Larry, line one. Is it Barry or Larry? Polarity, please. Larry? Um, excuse me, guys. Uh, I, had a, I had a quick call to take there. Um, uh, but anyways, uh, like I was saying, you know, uh, you know, you, you go out for a good little four pack of beer and whatnot, you know, you, you gotta have, you know, some bucks, uh, to spend in, in, in the wallet, you know? And, uh, oof, man, every time it's darn satisfying. Let's get another close up of that for you guys, huh? Look at that. Definitely cloudier than the last uh, dip -a I reviewed. Um, yeah, love it. I mean, it looks better than my face, I think. Um, but anyways, if you guys don't have any rock art dip -a in your refrigerator... I suggest you guys go down to the store and get yourself some right now. <laughs> um, but anyways, uh, thanks for uh, joining me, guys. And uh, thanks for all the support. And I uh, look forward to bringing a badass beer review for you guys all coming soon. G -g 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 get it, get it, get it, son. All right, y'all. Love y'all. Take care. God bless America. Peace.